Hey, Matt, um, how beneficial is it preparing for Saturday night, having played Lamar last year and firsthand getting to see the speed and agility and all of that that he brings to the table? Yeah, we had a little taste of it last year. Um, obviously, we lost that game. But it's a new season, a new team. But, um, yeah, I mean, he's just – you got to be ready to rock, you know. You can make anything happen at any time. So just being – being aware of him at all times is, is going to be key for us. Talking to some of the other guys, vision has been something that has been mentioned and, and agility and the challenge that he as a quarterback presents that's so unique. I mean, what is it, what does his vision as a ball carrier, what type of a challenge does that present you that, that other even mobile quarterbacks don't? Yeah. I mean, we just got to be sound tacklers. You know, a lot of other quarterbacks are just, running up, they're going to slide, they're going to do one cut and that's it. But with Lamar, you know, he's, he's a very uh, shifty guy. So just being able to, uh, being able to keep him contained is going to be, uh, going to be the big, biggest challenge for us. Some people will look at last year, the way you guys played them, even losing the game and say it was the blueprint. I believe the Titans even said that when they ended up beating him in the postseason later on last year, is it as simple as you, you have the confidence that you did it once that you can do it again, or, or are you completely wiping the slate clean? Um, yeah, I mean, we're pretty confident in um, our abilities here. What was it? I'm sorry, what was the question again? No, just because you did it once and you contained him in, in, at the height of his MVP season, I mean, is it? For the most part, yeah. I mean, can you, does that just give you the confidence that you can do it again, or, or is it something you just almost forget about last year? Uh, because this is a new year, new new team. Um, I mean, yeah, we're, we're pretty confident in being able to contain. Yes. Cool. Thanks, Matt. Appreciate it. Hey, Matt, Dan Fates in Rochester. You talk about being a sound tackler and all of those things. You learned first, you know, firsthand last year, you can kind of have Lamar bottled up and he still is tough to take down. Like, does it come down to, I know I hear vision, you hear all those things. It comes down to making a play, right? Got to make a play. That's it. That's what it really comes down to, just you making a play when it counts. <laughs> That's <laughs> easier more. said than done. Yeah, it's a lot easier said than done. Um, and then, you know, you talk about some guys saying, you know, contain, and then, and then it's don't want to be overly aggressive. Is there that fine line between being overly aggressive where Lamar can burn you, but not wanting to be sitting back and caught on your heels, right? Yeah, I think it's a fine line. I think once you try to uh, kind of – put a pin in exactly what it is to defend it. That's when you really lose. Um, you just got to go out there and, and make it happen. You know, don't think about it too much. Um, play fast, play free. Everybody's got to be running to the ball at all times because you never know when he's going to slip. So, yeah. Thanks, Matt. Yep. Good afternoon, Matt. George Radney, Challenger Community News. How are you doing this afternoon? Great. Great. Glad to hear it. Hey, the guys, since you guys have been playing without a true nose guard, without Star Lutule out there this, this entire season, how do you guys continue to plug up that middle, the, the, the in-between the tackle plays uh, this, uh, this coming week? I mean, we got, we got some dogs up there now. I wouldn't just write them off like that. Uh, Harry's been up there. Vern has been up there. Hugh's been up there. Ed's in there. You know, we got some guys in there. So they've been doing a great job all year and continuing to do that this uh, Saturday. Yeah, because looking at the film from last year's game, you guys did a very good job of containing him. He, he just a couple of plays here and there was the difference in that game. Do you see this one being another uh, tight, contested game this weekend? Absolutely. Absolutely. All right, great. Well, thank you for your time, and good luck on Saturday night. Thank you. Hey, how you doing? Dante Lasting, can you hear me? Yep. Right. Uh, just Talk to a little bit about the Ravens running backs and what they bring to this game. Um, yeah, two bigger guys. They run hard, downhill, fast, agile, make it happen. NFL running back. So <laughs> it's going to be right. a great challenge for us. Yeah, definitely. Uh, what have you seen from them out of the passing game? Um, in the passing game. The running backs you're talking about? Yeah. Um, they'll uh, They get out. Um, especially when they're four or five wide, um, good route runners, sound, catching the ball. Awesome. Good. Yeah, yep. thank you. Good luck this weekend. Yeah, appreciate it.